I'm Shay, Joseph and Jana, and um, I guess one of the few questions, or many questions we get is where the name come from, and I'll, it's a Latin for fellowship or brotherhood. Ever since we did that first experiment, it was just kind of like a full speed ahead three years of us collaborating together. As the size of this piece kind of dictated our collaborative process, because it put it in the very center of our studio. And typically we would take a single piece, and I would take it to my section of the studio and work on it until I figured it was done, or figured I was finished working with it. And I would hand it to Joseph, and he would do the same, or I'd hand it to Jana, either way, and they would work on it, and we'd rotate in this circle. Each person would work in their own individual studio. This piece, we could disassemble and take sections of it to our studio, but we could never, one artist could never really do one sweeping change to the whole piece, so this, these ideas and kind of the process slowly developed on this huge piece, and sections of it would be on the wall, and sections would be in our studio, and it would be kind of this weird time-lapse evolving of um, concepts as well as the aesthetics that make it what it is. You'd get a somewhat different answer, depending on who you ask, but I think we all kind of have uh, some of the similar feelings about it. It's uh, um, just sort of this sea of advertising and uh, of culture, basically, and about uh, um, the systems that we kind of create to uh, facilitate and, and to grow our culture. The colorful advertisements, kind of it's contrasting to the drab gray buildings and the colorful advertisements are catching your eye, kind of like the bright colorful flowers catch the bee's eye and attract it to it to pollinate. Every one of the panels are covered with um, found billboard pieces from all over the city. You know, when billboards come down or it <coughs> rains, you'll, f you know, for a brief second, it'll fall off of the billboard and be at the ground. And if we saw one, we'd rush out and grab it. So all of these are covered in old billboards, which if you ever get a chance to see, are just awesome. Because they're just layers and layers and layers of billboards on top of each other. And you can tear them away and see just like years of billboards built up, you know, into this inch thick piece of paper. It's hung right now kind of in its native format, like the way we, we made it. But we've also hung it in different ways, uh, turned pieces around. and. We like the idea that it is sort of compartmentalized to the point where you, you can you can rearrange it and kind of create a different context for it. And like one of the favorite ways I've ever we've ever hung it was when we hung it around the corner and it kind of went around the corner and it just had a really kind of cool dimension to it. For me, the work working in Sotolitas is interesting and awesome because it's like it's just always showing ways showing me ways of seeing things that I wouldn't have necessarily thought of by myself. I mean, it's like, I was just thinking about this today. We recently have gotten into sewing, and um, Shay brought a sewing machine home and started sewing, and like, hungry scavengers, like Joe and I will just start hovering over and go like, I wanna try, I wanna try, and so in a lot of ways, we just like feed off each other in this energy that we, you know, it's, it's, that's why I love it. <laughs> in the beginning, it started as an experiment, you know, just that uh, as well as the inspirational aspects of it just all have been what's keeping us to continue to do it. The audience, different people can can at the same time jump in from anywhere and, and can kind of relate to the work uh, in very different ways and people, you know, different people will relate to it differently and it makes sense still because we were relating to it very differently as we were creating it. We didn't try to figure out how it would work or why it would, you know, we, it's not like we sat down and wrote a big manifesto and, and said, you know, if we do this, we'll be showing the world that this, this, you know, it was just, just like. You wanted to write a manifesto. <laughs> <laughs> I still want to write a manifesto. <laughs> <laughs> we need a manifesto. <laughs>